everyone this is your kalpana here in this video we are going to solve an exact equation so let's get started problem solve x minus 3y plus 4 into dx plus 2y minus 3x minus 1 into dy equals to 0 solution given differential equation x minus 3x plus 4 into dx plus 2y minus 3x minus 1 into dy equals to 0. Consider it as equation 1 which is of m dx plus n dy equals to 0 form where by comparing these two, we will get m equals to x minus 3y plus 4 and n equals to 2y minus 3x minus 1. Okay. If partial derivative of m with respect to y is equal to partial derivative of n with respect to x, then we can say that the given differential equation is an exact equation. Okay. So, let's find the partial derivative of y sorry, of m with respect to y and partial derivative of n with respect to x. This is your m and this is your n. So, firstly, we are going to find the partial derivative of m with respect to y. This equals to dou by dou y of for m equals to x minus 3y plus 4. Since we are doing partial derivative with respect to y, so x and 4 and 3 are treated as constant. This equals to dou by dou y of x minus dou by dou y of 3y plus dou by dou y of 4 is equal to derivative of constant with respect to y is 0 minus you can write this as constant into partial derivative of y with respect to y plus derivative of constant with respect to y is 0 is equal to minus 3 into u you can write this as dou y by dou y is equal to minus 3 into partial derivative of y with respect to y is 1 equals to minus 3 okay now we'll find the partial derivative of a n with respect to x is equal to dou y dou x of n for n equals to 2y minus 3x minus 1. Since we are doing partial derivative with respect to x, so 2y, 3 and 1 are constants. Treated as constants, right? Is equals to dou y dou x of 2y minus dou y dou x of 3x minus dou y dou x of one equals to two and y are constants derivative of constant with respect to x is zero minus you can write this as three into partial derivative of x with respect to x minus partial derivative of one with respect to x is zero this is equals to minus three into you can write this as dou x by dou x partial derivative of x with respect to x is one minus 3 into 1 is equals to minus 3. So here, we got minus 3, right? Therefore, dou m by dou y equals to minus 3. And also we have minus 3 equals to dou n by dou x. From this, we'll get dou partial derivative of m with respect to y is equals to partial derivative of n with respect to x. Therefore, partial derivative of m with respect to y is equal to partial derivative of n with respect to x. From this, we can say that the given differential equation that is 1 is an exact equation. Right. So, now we need to find the general solution to the given exact equation. We know that. The general solution of 
exact equation is given by integral over x m into dx plus integral of terms of n free from x into dy equals to into constant c. Right. So let's consider the first integral. Integral over x m into dx. That is, we are going to integrate or by integrating m with respect to x, treating y as constant is equals to integral m for m equals to x minus 3y plus 4 into dx. So here 3y4 are constants, right? Integral x into dx minus integral 3y into dx plus integral 4 into dx. Let's write the constants outside the integral. Integral x into dx minus 3y are constants. So minus 3y into integral dx plus 4 is a constant. You can write this as 4 into integral dx. This is equals to integral x dx is x squared by 2. Minus 3y into integral dx is x. Plus 4 into integral dx is x is equals to x squared by 2 minus 3xy plus 4x. Okay. So integral over x m into dx is equals to x squared by 2 minus 3xy plus 4x. Now consider the second integral. Integral of terms of n free from x into dy. We are having n equals to 2y minus 3x minus 1, right? So the terms which are free from x are 2y and minus 1. So we'll take 2y and minus 1 here. This equals to integral of terms of n free from x are 2y minus 1 into dy. This equals to integral 2y dy minus 1 dy equals to 2 into integral y dy minus integral dy. is equals to 2 into integral y dy is y square by 2 minus integral dy is y y gets cancelled is equals to y square minus 1 okay therefore the general solution of the given exact equation is the result obtained from Integral over x m into dx that is x squared by 2 minus 3xy plus 4x plus result obtained from the second integral is y squared minus y equals to c. Then x squared by 2 minus 3xy plus 4x plus y squared minus y equals to c is a required general solution. So this completes the problem. So we have seen a problem from exact equation in this video. Hope you will understand. We will see you in the next video. Until then, bye bye.